Whole Foods said after opening their first store in New Hampshire and Nashua, they got the most requests from people in the Bedford area. And that's how this store came to be. It was a carnival-like atmosphere in Bedford Friday morning as people awaited the grand opening of Whole Foods. For others not lucky enough to win a gift card, the present was no longer having to commute. We go down to Nashua three times a week and um, we live here in town. We're just so excited that it's here. For the store manager, this is the second time around. He also presided over the grand opening a year and a half ago in Nashua. For this, we put, definitely put in a few other bells and whistles into the store. There's some new things. Um, we have a bakery department that you're really going to be right in the center of the action. Uh, we have a pub uh, with 24 taps. And if you need a place to get away from the crowds, there is a place to sit and enjoy one of those beers. The stores also pays homage to the former Wayfarer that used to be on this site. Some of the wood is from the original building, but ultimately, according to the customers, it's about the food. This is awesome. It's very overwhelming. It's a lot bigger than the one in Nashua, I do believe. A lot of the food is locally sourced, something the company prides itself on. The new store also means 155 jobs for the community. And Friday, it seemed that every one of those employees was needed to deal with the crush. Among those who attended the grand opening was the chair of the Bedford Board of Selectmen, who said this is a perfect example of how a public-private partnership should work. In Bedford, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.